Echo now. And it was simply, it is the Italian name. I've had two bottles of beer um, and some stuff that uh, I bought at the supermarket yesterday. I'm waiting for my train, which uh, is the only train from Fume Orieta to uh, Budapest. Just over an hour. The place I normally uh, wait for my train because the train station is just literally over there. So I just have to walk across the street. It's half past six, another half an hour before my train leaves. I'm on the platform now in Fiume, or the local name is Rieka. Um, this is the train. I've got to find the carriage. Uh, the party starts, hopefully. Okay, so this is my, um, it's my, my little room for the trip. Uh, he's just given me this, the best Hungarian dry, uh, white wine, uh, Prosecco, Champagne, I don't know, but um, to add to my, to the number of drinks that I have, uh, there is some snacks, I've got my own snacks, but um, it is so hot in here, um, he's just told me that it's like 60 years old, this train, uh, this is the air conditioning, yeah. he's uh, pulling my leg. Um, it's going to be an interesting journey. I don't have to share this with anyone so I can relax, I can have a party. And I've just been asked um, what breakfast I want tomorrow. So I've said sort of coffee and pate. It's departure time now and we are leaving. <laughs> Yaka. Amazingly, the doors, <laughs> the doors were open. and we should be in Budapest in 13 hours just before 9 o'clock tomorrow Ljubljana, but say that uh, I have been kind of stoned out of my mind after drinking too much alcohol within uh, Rijeka. I was asleep within half an hour, within 25 minutes of this train leaving many years ago. It's a lovely place and uh, it has a uh, lake of bled, the famous lake bled, which is incredibly beautiful. Um, I'm surprised that I haven't been back here since and I, I stayed in a converted prison when I was here all those years ago, which was a lot of fun. She asked me whether, which cell I wanted to, to uh, stay in. So it's 10.30, we've been here for about half an hour now in Ljubljana station. Um, some other oh thank you <laughs> hello <laughs> hi <laughs> camaraderie she's just uh, as you can see um because i've heard some singing uh, they're, they're singing down there three women So 
they're singing down there in their carriage. Um, I'm not quite sure when we're going to be on our way. I'm not even sure when we're, whether we're still on time now. So you've got people running up and down the line, like checking the bogeys on the train. Uh, so it seems a bit kind of, kind of complicated. Um, and that's why it is taking so long to dance on the platform here in Ljubljana and just walking underneath. The joys of international travel across uh, different countries here in Europe. Um, nobody's asked me for my passport yet. Uh, because this is, uh, I'm in passing from uh, Ljubljana, uh, sorry, passing from Rijeka to Croatia to uh, Slovenia, that's in the Schengen area. Uh, but I will be asked, I'll be woken up uh, tomorrow when I'm passing from Hungary to Romania. Very interesting. The guard has just knocked at my door and uh, warned me that uh, I have to be very careful with um, my tablet, i.e. my iPad and phone. Clothes, he said, is not a problem. But he said, uh, tablets, iPhones, uh, money, problem and all I've done since we have left Rijeka is I've only been to the toilet once <laughs> I told him that I've only been to the toilet once which was like one minute um two minutes um but you know he has warned me that he was walking outside and he saw the tablet um and so uh, Unlike good old Croatia, which apparently somebody has told me, um, my new artist friend in Croatia, one of them, told me that it's 24th safest country in the world. We're back to uh, the, the kind of mentality of um, being super safe uh, with your electronic uh, gadgets so and we're in Slovenia we have moved forward but I didn't really expect that we'd be going because uh, on the base of last year we were kind of moving backwards and forwards from the station uh, we've moved out of the station but I guess we're going to be moving back into the station which is down that way I really can't understand why something that gives um, a trick that they do every night that they're doing every night so, the, 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 these people who are walking up and down no wonder he's kind of warned me because I don't know that these people have anything they don't like dressed and as workers. So we're moving out of Ljubljana station, but I'm not at all convinced that this is the final, final movement. It's been one hour, 20 minutes that we've been in Ljubljana station going in and out, changing platform.
30 minutes out. We've got about 40 minutes out from uh, Budapest. Soon going to be in Budapest. Ah, here we are, Budapest, Delhi. There you go. I've got to sprint across to the next station for tonight's train, Budapest, um, Kaleti. 